Hi everyone and welcome to Things with Parramatta where we explore the A to Z of Parramatta Heritage Centre's cultural collections. I'm Natalie, the cultural collections officer. Did you guess the answer to the clue? A porcelain pudding surprise with a sinister backstory? The mystery object beginning with the letter F is a frozen Charlotte doll. This tiny doll was recovered from the Queen's Wharf West archaeological excavation site. Although it is headless, it is believed to be a frozen Charlotte doll. Frozen Charlottes have origins dating back to 1850 Germany when they were produced as children's bath toys. The dolls were typically made of porcelain with unmovable limbs attached to a nude body and pale white skin with only a tinge of colour on the face and hair. The dolls became very popular in Britain and America in the 19th and 20th centuries where they were baked into cakes and Christmas puddings as lucky charms. But in 1840, an article was published in the New York Observer about a vain young woman called Charlotte who suffered a serious misfortune on the way to a New Year's ball. Not wanting to cover up her beautiful gown, she refused to listen to her mother's plea to dress warmly and, as a consequence, froze to death in her carriage. The article was discovered by a writer named Seba Smith who was inspired to write a poem called A Corpse Going to a Ball. His poem then inspired a folk ballad called Fair Charlotte and so because of their resemblance to a white corpse and the association with the poem and ballad, these dolls got the nickname Frozen Charlotte. I hope you enjoyed this chilling story. If you have a special object or heirloom that starts with the letter F, I'd love to hear about it. Please email me at localstudies at cityofparamatta.newsouthwales.gov.au. Your clue for the next mystery object starting with the letter G is, sounds fishy but you can't lose your marble. See you soon.